Thanks for tuning in to Let's Talk About It Media 21. I hope you're having a great day. Stay positive, stay focused. Let's get to it. What is the hot topic that's going on on YouTube or Instagram? Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976, allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships and research. Fair use is use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only. Don't forget, the Cash App is Let's Talk About It Media. Thank you for all your love and support. So don't forget to like, to comment, but be kind, and also turn on the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you'll be the first one to see it. So we've been following this story. There are other legal analysts, journalists that's been following this story way more than I have because they have the legal documents, just giving advice, just um, talking about what I've read or seen. All comments are alleged. Okay, so let's get into what's basically being reported today. Okay, so it's basically saying judge denies Kevin Hart restraining order against Tasha Kay and the request to get his interview with his former assistant removed. It's just not really. Okay, so I can't certain words I can't say overboard request that does not address the actual malice. So the biggest thing is, if they're saying it doesn't address the, the actual malice, the whole interview, if there's any malice at all. But when you look at the actual interview, everybody said it was kind of general, but she did state that she was under an NDA. Now, maybe the NDA is over. And someone was the saying that he allegedly paid a pretty good penny for the NDA up front, but maybe people need to do a 10 year, 15 year or 20 year because by 20 years, everybody's going to be like, who, you know what I'm saying? Maybe a three year, five years, not enough. And maybe <laughs> someone was saying he had saw uh, someone do an NDA and it was not as much as Kevin Hart spent. And it's kind of like, okay, you have these NDAs and people are not following it. And you have to basically say, even if what information I give you, your friends, your family can't tell what you know, because then that makes you liable. Because if only you, my lawyer, and another person knows, we know it's going to be you breaking the NDA. So there's always so many issues with people in the industry and their contracts. So the biggest thing is the judge denied it. And um, watching a few different people, I guess since... Kevin Hart put in the request for the restraining order. It's been denied. Tasha Kay allegedly did respond with the new lawyer. She's not with Olga in regards to this. Many people have a lot of things alleged to say about who will her lawyer be in regards to this. So she still has the bankruptcy going on. Many people are saying, should Kevin have filed a complaint with Tasha Kay knowing she's under bankruptcy? Should he have waited? But I think he didn't want to wait because he probably wanted to do the restraining order, maybe, and he wanted the video down. So since the judge denied it, of course, Ta Tasha K speaks on, she has lawyers now. And I think she runs a lot, a lot of stuff through her lawyers before she does it. But Tasha, Kevin Hart feels a way about this video being up. Tasha K speaking to the ex-assistant. Well wishes. Um, they were saying that Will and Jada was thinking about also filing one as well, whether they were going to file Mr. Bala or they were going to file a, less, a, a lawsuit with Tasha K. But what well wishes? Let me go through the other clips. Um, Let me see. How do I want to? Do, 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 do. Yeah. So, of course, you have the Kevin Hart suing Tasha K trying to say it was extortion. All comments are alleged. I can't confirm or deny if there was actual extortion or not, because when I hear different people, someone said it was an extortion situation on behalf of information for Tasha. But Tasha was like, I didn't say that. I didn't send that. 
I don't know what that is. So there's a lot that's actually going on. And mind you, Tasha K's old assistant is no longer there. What was her name? Chelsea? So who knows what that's all about? So a lot of this is going to have to play out in court. And then, of course, you have the actual interview. So I'm not going to play the clip. But yeah, the judge has denied Kevin Hart's request. Well wishes to Tasha K. Many people feel, is it time? Does she love to do these interviews where it's going to be a wild factor, but is it worth it if you have to hire an expensive attorney? Is it that? Is it worth it? The clicks of views by the time, and people say, well, you make the money, people continue to watch the videos, is it worth it? A lot of times, lawyers want a lot of money up front, especially in her situation with Cardi B. It's like, where does she, ever, where does she get the money for the lawyer? If there's a holdup in regards to Cardi B being paid. So what wishes? It's a lot. Is it worth it? You know, that's why I say alleged. Some people, that might bother people. I don't care. If if we hear things or we see things, and that's why I also post, what whether it's the neighborhood talk, whether it's the shade room, whether it's Hollywood Unlock, I always post where, where it's coming from. Yeah, I could just do the picture and just kind of go from there. I've watched people just talk about stuff. And you got to figure out who the people are. Love that. Might start doing that. Um, but yeah, judge denied it. Well wishes to Kevin. I will keep on this and stay on this because let's see what happens in the next um, up and coming months. Will he continue to try and sue because she's under trying to file for bankruptcy? Will the bankruptcy situation be a situation? Because people were saying she filed and people are concerned if she gave the proper amounts of what she makes monthly. Tasha has over a million subscribers. Some people that have less than a million subscribers showed us how much they make every six months. And it's like, wow, that's a decent amount. So it's like, she's got to be making more and more than I'm making. So well wishes. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe is free. Support the channel best way you can. Everyone, have a great day. Focus on healthy, safe relationships. Be around people that are strong in mind, body, soul, and spirit.